Well, it finally happened today. They came in the Hornady Bore Driver ELDX 50 cal, 340 grain muzzleloader bullets. These have been hyped up. Nobody's had them. It's just kind of been a mystery. And I finally got my hands on some. These things are massive. So I have been shooting the bore driver FTXs in the 290 grain for the 50 cal out of my CVA Optima V2 50 cal and had tremendous results. Tremendous. We are sub MOA. Somebody's are punching through the same hole at 100 yards with a muzzle loader. It is insane, insane. The FTXs, I mean, the bullet retention at 100 yards hitting milk jugs. Uh, we have not had a chance to do ballistic tests yet, but just milk jugs. The expansion, the retention, this 290 grain weighed was at 289.9. The only thing not on there is a little red tip. So this is the FTX. This is what I've been shooting. And this is what we're going to be testing. From what I've heard, it's a game changer. It's going to be the best muzzle loading bullet available on the market. The BCs on this new FTX are supposed to be at 315, I believe, versus around 135 with the FTX. This thing is going to shoot so straight. I, I am beyond excited to go out and shoot this tomorrow morning. It's way too hot right now. It's uh like 95 degrees out here in Idaho, bright sun. So tomorrow morning when it's a little cooler, more towards hunting temperatures for elk coming up here real soon. Gonna try this baby out. Look at the difference in that. Holy smokes. I mean, I know it's only, you know, 50 green, but that thing is gonna fly so straight and so much faster. I can't wait to chronograph this. These guys right now, we're getting about 1,700 feet per second out of the muzzle with 120 grains of Pyrodex Select by volume. I know a lot of people don't like to measure their stuff out, but I do that also. It makes things a little bit more consistent. And I think that's how we're getting such tight groups out of our muzzle loaders is making sure everything is repeated as precisely as possible. I know some people think it's above and beyond. I actually separate all my bullets, weigh them out. Now, if you're fine with shooting two, three inch groups at hundred yards, that, that's fine. I like punching holes in the same hole repeatedly. And that's what uh, being a little OCD with your bullets, your powder, your process can get you. Okay, guys, I will uh, do some range time tomorrow and let you guys know what uh, what's going on.